How you doing everyone? Welcome back. We're going to have a quick look at Polyswarm, the NCT token. And um, on the information that I've got, I've run a couple of fibs and it kind of, it, it does seem to tie in with both fibs, uh, with what's happening. It doesn't help that from release we had a big pump and dump and a continuation of the dump, protection bounce and then we are where we are. So it's a difficult one to get a true reflection of price action on when looking at the daily chart um, so essentially what I'm going to say is as I'm expecting Bitcoin to have a downturn um, realistically we are going to come back to circa um, the 436 zone possibly make a new all-time low for a quick retracement back up to circa 52 I think at that point we're going to consolidate before we move higher back up to circa the seven cent range and then another period of consolidation before we begin staircasing as long as bitcoin is um, moving sideways or higher and i think the moment that we break um eight five and then significantly break nine two that's going to be our moonshot um so do watch out for um for nine two four and i'm just going to put that in here as blue I think once we break that that area there we're going to be away and gone now although we have got a number of significant um, resistance channels here they've not really had a chance to be tested other than where we've been stopping on the way down um, the one that has been acting um, as a really strong resistance and support is circa um, eight and a half cents uh, as you can see, once we have fallen below, we've struggled to get back above on one, two, three occasions. So uh, I think once we're free of 8.5 and then break this Fibonacci resistance um, at 9.2, we should see a really good move. And I think at about the, the 10, 11 cent mark, that's when retail is going to get involved and move this thing 50% higher than it is. So uh, not financial advice. Um, as such, I'm going to mark this blue because this could play out or something completely different could as well um, but that's just my best advice and prediction that we're going to see a new all-time low um, before we start to have uh, a climb to the upside and then once we build that foundation of support we'll have a little pump and retail will get involved and we'll be away and gone from there obviously uh, we're going to have a sell-off and at that point the sell-off would probably bring us back to the top of this uh, support resistance zone realistically at about eight and a half nine cents so however high we go and however quick we get there more than likely we'll come straight back to that area all right best of luck see you on the next one